Hello, this video is to show you how to use the Adalify API in order to send an SMS from your own Twilio account. Um, so you can see here, um, we've made a page with, uh, I don't know why that says current time. <laughs> okay, so we've got a text field for the two number, uh, the phone number we're sending a message to, and we've got a field for what the message is. Um, then on the send button, um, we've got a custom action. So you need to set up um, a custom action. You can call it what you like. Um, okay, and this is your end point here. And you're going to get that. If you look in the Adalify docs, you can see uh, for the Twilio SMS, this is the end point here. So that's going to be there. Uh, the method will be post. Right, and we need our authorization. Uh, the authorization is bearer, space, and your Adalify API key, uh, which is on your dashboard here. Okay, um, so you put in your API key, and then the other things we're going to need, um, we're going to put as query parameters. So if we look here, in the docs, we've got our string parameters. We're going to need Twilio account ID. This is from your own Twilio account. You need the Twilio auth token. Again, uh, that is from your own Twilio account. Um, we need two, which is the two number and uh, the from number. Here we, we it, um, we've got an underscore after it, so just um, don't forget to put that in there. And then body will be body of the message. Um, so simple as that. Query parameter two is going to be two. Um, these are going to be your um, account ID, auth token, your from number. Don't forget the um, underscore here. Also, these uh, parameters are case sensitive. Okay, so uh, pay attention to the case. And the last thing is going to be the body. All right, so we've got our inputs here: um, the body, the from, and the two. Um, just note the from number needs to be an authorized phone number that you have on your Twilio account. Um, so this is actually a number I've got set up on the Twilio account. Um, so just remember to do that or it's not going to work. You can't um, put any number there. It must be on your Twilio account. Um, so once you've got all of these set up, okay, um, we can just press run test request test successful and we've got an output here telling us that it's been successful okay uh, we can also get a status message here um, which is just uh, the same but it's not boolean it's just text so we can save that custom action and let's preview to try it out um, Twilio SMS uh, we need our two number the message okay and press send um, and that is going to send uh, the SMS from um, our own Twilio accounts if I look on my phone now I've just got a message hello testing the Adalify API perfect okay that's all thank you if you have any questions feel free to ask